You know gasoline prices are high, but did you know they've broken a record? Since mid-December, the price has been rising three cents a week and now averages $3.48 a gallon. That is the highest price ever in February, when lighter demand usually holds prices down. We asked Bill Whitaker to look into what this could do to the economy. With 700 trucks, Dependable Highway Express is one of LA's busiest trucking firms. CEO Ron Massman now spends $13 million a year on fuel. He fears sharply rising prices will drag down a fragile economy. Virtually everything that you touch and see is handled by a truck, from you know, appliances to clothing and to food items. As fuel prices go up, so will the cost of transporting those goods. To cut costs, he's installed solar panels, bought fuel-efficient trucks, offered bonuses to drivers who use less fuel. Is it going to be enough to make up for the increase in fuel if it gets up to $4 a gallon? No. The only way that we can recover that cost is to pass it along to our customers. Two factors are behind the spike in gasoline prices. Four U.S. refineries are down for maintenance, cutting supply and investors now see profit in gasoline. They've bought up more than 4 billion gallons, pushing up prices at the pump. As for the trucking industry, Scott, economists say every 10 cents added to a gallon of gas costs consumers $9 billion. Bill, thank you very much.